Hello, I'm Maris Buzalis. I'm 18 years old. I'm from Chicago, Illinois, and I play at Sunrise Christian Academy. What is your favorite inspirational quote today? I go off of, I'd probably say, a Kobe quote, rest at the end, not in the middle. Probably my favorite quote of all time. You gotta get up every day and just grind, you know, no days off, even if you're tired for a game day. <laughs> you just gotta go and get it every day. Rest at the end. What's the biggest thing you're getting ready for right now? I'm getting ready for G League. I'm trying to get stronger. I'm trying to get, I'm working on everything right now. Everything has to be sharper, so. <laughs> Who is your biggest opponent currently? My opponent right now is just, I'd say, just myself, just me. I'm playing, I'm working against myself every day. It's, everything's in here for basketball. What kind of basketball player are you? Um, I could pretty much do it all, I say. Um, I could dribble, I can pass, I could shoot, you know. <laughs> At my height, too, everyone thinks it's impressive. I just work on you know, working on everything, so. What would be your constructive criticism to yourself today? Um, I wouldn't say criticism, I'd say I'm, I'm just gonna keep being aggressive, keep shooting the ball, you know? Just, I'm not gonna just let loose and start passing, but. If I'm really in a slump, I'm gonna just try to find my teammates more, so. You're down and there's a halftime speech. Here's what I believe. This is, this, is, this is a bold statement. I believe we should score every possession against this team. And I believe we should get a stop every possession. Sorry. Every possession. Every one of them. I think we should score every possession and we should get a stop every possession. Anybody disagree with that? No, sir. So then if we don't do that, we're not succeeding. Who's the first person you fall back to during hard times? On my team, I'd say Miro. He. He helps me a lot, he's always encouraging. Best NBA prospect, and he's not in his feelings, and he listens to me. 100%. In front of Larry Markkinen. Yeah, Larry go, Larry go get that too. Also Almar, he's a, those two. and in your life, at the current stage of your life? I wouldn't even say on the court, I'd say my dad. I always talk to him after the game. He always watches, sometimes he can't watch, but I always talk to my dad. How do you get up? I just say just keep 
having the same energy, you know, encourage everyone around so they'd all be on the same page and, you know, you're in this together, so just everyone has to be on the same page all the time. Be aggressive, be aggressive. The aggressor always wins, right? Yes, sir! Let's have fun and play together. Together on three, together on three. One, two, three. Together. Let's go, let's go. Come on, baby, come on, baby. Come on, baby. Do you feel pressure? No. Never. I was just always raised. There's no pressure from my family raised me right. There's no pressure ever. So with that, I would like to give the MVP award from Lithuania, Matas Kuzelis. Where do you find energy within yourself to go that extra mile? I just say thinking, I always think of my grandma every time if I'm like, if I'm like tired, I'm like, I'm doing this for my grandma, you know? I always think of her and she helps and I just push through. Even if I'm exhausted, I, I always push through. Why grandma? Is there any story? Is there any oh. special bond you, you made together? My, I know my grandma is always watching me. So I always think of her and my grandpa. There's always, I know they're always on the couch watching, taking the time out of their day, so. What's your biggest strength right now? I'd say that I can make the right basketball play if I have the ball in my hands. I won't do, I always, if someone, if they double team, I'm going to find the open man and, I'm, and we're going to win the game from that, you know. Even if he misses, that's a good basketball play. What is the most significant thing in your life at the moment, aside from basketball? I'd say just my, my team. My team, just even if we lose, we're, we got to go and talk about what we did wrong. You know, if we win, we're excited, we're talking about the game. <laughs> And then after the day after, I can, I'm going to celebrate wins and losses because, you know, if you lose, you're going to learn something from that. Amen. Amen. Yo, Saran's on three, family together on six. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Together. I got time to shoot. You know, don't take a loss as like, it's the end of the world. The sun's going to come up tomorrow, so I just say, yeah, I'd say that. Thank you for this game, Matas. Yep, thank you.